欢庆美国独立日总少不了烟花助兴，但电光火石的背后也暗藏着巨大的危险。周五上午，包括加州消防局、洛杉矶县和各城市的十九个警消部门，向民众重申了非法燃放烟花的危害。官员指出，去年独立日前后，全美有超过一万一千人因烟花爆竹受伤，而仅洛杉矶县消防局去年就处理了五十三起因烟花引发的房屋火灾。Of these 53 fires, 27 were caused by illegal fireworks. 23 were undetermined in nature. And three were from safe and sane fireworks. Across California, including here in the Southland, we have a zero tolerance towards the use of illegal fireworks. 他解释道，非法烟花的种类包括凭火箭烟花、樱桃爆竹、鞭炮等没有正规密封、会在空中爆炸或在地面飞窜的所有物体。值得注意的是，即使是合法烟花，在洛杉矶等城市以及国家森林中也禁止燃放。Even the use of safe and sane fireworks purchased legally, taken to a community that does not allow them, is considered illegal and does bring、uh, stiff fines along with it. We'll be fined with a minimum of five hundred dollar citation, and certain cities have a,、uh, a citation fee of five thousand dollars. It depends on every situation, but some people who are selling illegal fireworks they can be arrested and taken to jail for possessing illegal fireworks. 从去年独立日至今，加州已经查获了超过二十五万磅非法烟花，且执法人员发现，非法烟花的买卖渠道已不再局限于街头交易。As criminal activity has really transitioned in the last 15 years with illegal fireworks, from just selling them in the back of a trunk on the street to using the internet, using social media sites, community selling sites to sell their platforms. 警方强调。加州民众在网上买到的所有烟花都属于违法，在任何区域都不允许燃放。We urge everyone to please enjoy the holiday responsibly and safely by, a, by attending a professional fireworks show. 新唐人电视台记者李佳音、朱利安，洛杉矶采访报道。